We've actually seen it around here too. A manhole cover blew sky high in downtown Cincinnati. That was three years ago. WLWT News 5's Janelle Walton live right now with the changes being made to keep another explosion like that from happening here. Janelle? Mike, that explosion at the corner of 4th and Main was blamed on some type of electrical problem underground. Duke Energy got to work right away trying to figure out the problem, trying to solve it. And three years later, the utility company is locking down manhole covers. Oh my God. Hey, I got that on film. We first showed hey, you the video I three years ago. Film. Employees at Goodman and Goodman had just arrived to work at the law office on 4th Street. Oh, it was very scary. The, the building shook. You could hear the explosion. And then fire was shooting out of the hole in the ground. A gas buildup around underground electrical cables shot three 100 pound manhole covers straight into the air. Oh, it blew the man cover off. This cell phone video was shot from the atrium building. Since then, Duke Energy has been researching the problem. So when those gases release, they, they are sadly uh, combustible. And if, if they build and an arc takes place, then it can cause one of these to be launched. The fix, install a new swivel lock system. At first glance, you wouldn't notice anything different from any other manhole cover, but take a closer look. There's a new white locking device. Allows it to be locked down, also allows that, uh, that manhole cover actually sits itself back down if something were to ever be launched, and it would sit still on the frame and allow for those gases to uh, be exhausted. The fix comes just in time for this year's All Star game when hundreds of baseball fans will be walking from their hotels to Great American Ballpark. I think it's great that Duke's working to keep us safe. Uh, they've got a commitment to our, our city, and I'm, I'm proud of that. And Duke has already replaced 300 manhole covers in the downtown area, and the plan is to retrofit another 80 manhole covers this year. Janelle Walton, WLWT News 5. All right, Janelle, with information you'll see only here on WLWT, Duke Energy says it costs $6,400 to replace each manhole cover. So far, Duke has spent $1.9 million on the project.